I'd like to, you to meet my new favorite toy. I use this at the moment at least twice a week. It's the ATX Hex compact track bar. And the reason why I've been using it, I had a bit of a knee issue. I haven't been training legs and I'm just sort of getting back into it. I haven't been deadlifting. So I, I thought I'd give this a try. I started out, I was using it actually for farmer's walks. It's so much easier to load up than having two independent handles and a couple of laps up and down here. It's got a, a knurled 32 mil grip. So with a decent weight on there, it doesn't take long for the grip to be torched. Um, but now I've been using it lately as a, as a leg exercise, plus also too, to sort of slowly ease myself back into deadlifts. And I've just found it really, really handy and I, I get a lot out of it. Got loads of leg machines in the showroom that I can use, but I find that this, this is um, really beneficial sort of gives me sort of 70 to 80% of the, the leg workout of say a, a leg press, but also too works my grip and, and sort of getting me ready to get back into deadlifts. Now four legs. I use sort of a bit of a different method. I don't use any um, rubber flooring because I'm just gonna go down and gently touch. But you can see, because it doesn't have the elevated handles, you have to go deeper. And yeah, I've, I've found it really good and, and, and we'll get a few close-ups and you'll see the things beat up after only a few months. I've been using it that much. Now, to um, put it in perspective, um, for years, we're, we're waiting for a more compact version of the um, the famous ATX Extra Large Hex Trap Bar. This one is now a bolt, bolt, bolt version. So before it used to come fully welded and shipping used to be a nightmare. So this is literally half the price of what the old one used to be. So we're waiting for years. I've had this up and running for um, a couple of weeks now and I haven't even touched it. Um, admittedly, I'm not trying to lift heavy weights, but the compact one is just so so much easier to get out. I've just got it hung up on the wall over there. So it's just, I, I just really like the ease of, of use. Now, I wouldn't recommend the, the compact bar for, for someone that wants to actually lift heavy um, weight with a deadlift. You are gonna max out the weight on, on that, that one. With the, the low handles, you, you will um, only be able to lift less weight than with the elevated handles. So, you know, you're not gonna need the same amount of weight storage, but still, if you wanna build serious strength, definitely get the bigger one. The compact one, what I'd recommend that for is, say if you've got a, a home gym and you've got a, a triplex multi-gym, or you might just have, say, a bench and a set of Ironmaster dumbbells and you're looking to do some leg work, that is perfect. If you haven't got space, um, if you're in a tiny spot, that's great. Um, I'd even recommend taking it to the park because it's so easy to get out of your car. Just take a pair of 20s and do farmer's walks. Great way to do your conditioning and get a bit of strength work in as well. Um, yeah, it's just so convenient and the proof's in the pudding. You'll see it's beaten up and I've got all these fancy leg machines here. I still use them, but the fact that I'm, I'm getting that out, um, honestly, it's, as I said, it, 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 uh, I'm doing these videos for people that are in, um, you know, they're setting up a home gym, they're tight on space or they're on a budget. Uh, something cheap and, and effective like that is, is gonna really add to your workout.